Hi everyone, in today's video, I'll guide you on how to install a Windows 10 Pro virtual machine using VMware Workstation Pro. Before we begin, you'll need two things, the VMware Workstation Pro software and a Windows 10 ISO file. Check out the links to the two previous videos in the description where I've explained how to get them. Now, let's start setting up the Windows 10 virtual machine. First, open VMware Workstation Pro. On the main interface, click Create a new virtual machine. In the new window, select Typical, Recommended, to simplify the setup process, then click Next. At the step where you choose the ISO file, select Installer Disk Image File ISO. Click Browse, find the Windows 10 Pro 64-bit ISO file you downloaded earlier, and click Next. In the next step, name your virtual machine, for example, Windows 10 VM, and choose where you want to save it on your computer. When configuring disk size, I recommend setting it to at least 60 gigabytes to ensure the system runs smoothly. Choose Store Virtual Disk as a single file to optimize performance, then click Next. The next step involves configuring the virtual machine's hardware. By default, the VM will use 2 GB of RAM and 2 CPU cores. Depending on your computer's specs, you can click Customize Hardware to adjust these settings. After that, click Finish to complete the virtual machine setup. The VM will now begin the installation process. At this point, there's an important note. During the first boot, the installation process will prompt you to press any key on your keyboard. If you miss this step, the VM will reboot, and you'll need to start over. Next, select your language, time, and keyboard preferences, then click Next. Click Install Now. If you don't have a product key, click I don't have a product key, then click Next. In the next step, select the version of Windows 10 you want to install. I recommend choosing Windows 10 Pro as it's widely used and doesn't require an online Microsoft account later in the setup. Click Next to continue. Choose Custom, then select the 60GB drive you created earlier. Click Next, and the installation will begin. Once the installation is complete, you'll need to go through some initial setup steps to finalize the process. Follow the on-screen instructions to complete the Windows 10 setup. After reaching the Windows 10 desktop, it's important to install VMware tools so the VM can display the correct screen resolution. To do this, click on the VM menu at the top, then select Install VMware Tools. Run the Setup64 file to install VMware tools, and then restart the virtual machine. And that's it. With just a few simple steps, we've successfully installed Windows 10 on a virtual machine using VMware Workstation Pro. If you found this video helpful, please like the video to support the channel. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.